you probably wouldn't guess it from the overwhelming UFO sightings that occur in North America and Europe, mainly the UK, but other parts of the world also see and study UFOs, most notably is South Korea, where the next video was captured. Originally posted by Suspect Sky on X, little is given about the background of the sighting and where exactly in South Korea. What we see is multiple orbs appear, fizzle out and reappear in various areas of the sky. All we know about this video is it was captured somewhere in Mexico, possibly a truck stop near the southern border of the United States. I did a little research and found that the Goodyear blimp was in San Diego, California on January 26th for a golf opening. So is this what we are looking at? In the city of Niteroi, just east of Rio de Janeiro in Brazil, two women find themselves recording a strange spectacle in the nighttime sky from their balcony. Filmando. Gente, amiga, que loucura! Porque o canhão de luz, ele vai no, no sentido só, que esse tá vindo pra cá, tá vindo pra lá. Nossa, muito louco isso, muito esquisito, gente. Nunca vi. É estranho. Não é estranho? Será que é pra ter alguma coisa na praia, fora aí? Ah, aí tem tá até no... Tem alguma iluminação lá? Não. Sexta, Muito amiga. esquisito. Pode ser, hein? Não tinha um palco montado lá, ia ter um evento lá. Amiga, e cara ia pra lá. Aqui é Santa Rosa. Ali é Santa Rosa. É, não. É. Tá longe. Muito esquisito. Não, se bem que foi um não. Diz, ele vai longe. Né? É, mas não é um, é um sol ou dois, não é esse monte aí que tá rodando aí, não. É estranho. Muito esquisito, eu nunca vi assim. Se for canhão de luz, tá muito diferente do que eu costumo lá. Eles se espalham, tá vendo? É. As mentioned in the video text, the individual was at a McDonald's when this strange object appeared above the building. Would love to hear your opinions. By now, everyone has some familiarity of SpaceX and its barrage of rocket launches that almost seem to happen daily from their bases. However, on the night of March 4th, over Oklahoma City, a family captured a typical launch that doesn't quite add up. Take a look. Oh, wow. Look, it's separating from itself. What the hell is that? It's shooting out some sort of... Sound wave. 
What is that? Like some sort of like pulse energy or something. Like the strange part is the local news agency wanted to know what it was and reached out to local officials. On March 4th, SpaceX did have a launch, but the launch was at 7 p.m. Eastern Time in Florida, whereas this was nearly 7.30 Central Time in Oklahoma, and people were viewing it from the West. So are other rockets being launched that we don't hear about, or is this some sort of orbital change attempt by SpaceX? Frequent ex-user John Bell has two years of footage that he records from his yard where he has witnessed a treasure trove of aerial phenomenon that leaves most skeptics scratching their heads. A few nights ago, while using his laser pen, he seemed to have made contact. Have a look for yourself. It's a very big, very bright spear. UFO coming right out of the north. See how blindingly bright it is. Smaller object over here. This is over on the east coast, by the way. <laughs> There he goes. He's coming over. It's up there, buddy. He's very large. Extremely bright. I'm going to have to get up out of my recliner to continue the video on him. He has gone past me a little bit now. There's a power line in the yard. That's how low he is. I get it. Turning back to Oklahoma real quick, this sighting was captured near Edmond. According to the uploader, they'd been a fan of ufology and caught this triangle formation the other night while watching the skies. It's so high, dude. Right, right that here. Look, there's another way one. Way too fucking fast, bro. What is that one? <gasps> oh, whoa! 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 Oh, whoa! whoa! It's so high, dude. Right, right that here. Look, there's another one. Way too fucking fast, bro. What is that one? <gasps> oh, whoa! 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 Oh, whoa! 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 Look, is it recording in mine? Look. You record now, record. Yeah, sure. I'll send you the video too. Don't scream, kiddo. I don't know what the heck they are doing. Yeah, it's enough, I guess. Why are they like shining in a triangle? Santa? Bro, am I tripping? Bro, what the fuck? This odd video has commentators believing they may be witnessing a glitch in the matrix. Like so much UFO footage on the internet, the original source couldn't be found. Some argue it's a dirty window, 
but it seems obvious that he is outside perhaps at a skate park. What do you think of this? The next video was filmed by a boat crew somewhere along the lake of Buenos Aires two years ago. Unfortunately, I don't speak Spanish, so I can only imagine all of the comments in Spanish are of fear and wonder. Take a look. Al fondo allá, a la orilla del, del, de la montaña allá. ¿Me que sea un punto negro? Ya. Ahí está apareciendo de nuevo. Ahí está apareciendo de nuevo. Nítido. El otro está ahí. El otro punto negro se está viendo delante del islote marcado. Can Jackson a las espaldas del primer punto negro. Punto desconocido. Aparecieron. Y el otro estaba más. A la izquierda, también visual. While waiting at a bus stop one early morning in Thornton, Colorado, the witness of the next video spotted a cigar-shaped object that didn't quite look right in the sky. Take a look for yourself. The witness had this to add about their encounter. I noticed something bright in the sky. I pulled out my phone and shot a video of what does admittedly look like a bunch of balloons. At some point near the beginning of the video, there is a faint white cigar shaped something that flies across the screen under the shiny mass. What the fuck is that? What in the hell?
Lastly for the week, YouTube user Alkloptrip sent us an image of what his friend captured around 10pm one night in the western part of Belgium. I have never seen anything like it, but if you have seen something similar, please let us know in the comments. Both Kloptrip and I would appreciate it. Thanks for staying until the end of the video. If you enjoyed this, please consider leaving a like and subscribing if you haven't. Also, we love to hear your opinions on what you've seen today. Until next week, take care everyone.